Day 2083. Life on Namek has become miserable. These mushrooms are my only friends. I've killed everyone else. Well, apart from that one guy you may have seen in the distance, because I didn't see him when the world was rendering. Damn you! Why are you here? Why are you alive? Taunting me? You're probably just a ghost. A former shell of what you were once. Ah, God damn it, Napa. If only I hadn't killed you. You'd still be here. Watching over me. <laughs> hey guys, how's it going? I'm Mega G Wolf, and welcome back to Let's Play Minecraft, the Dragon Block C mod. Uh, yeah, about that intro, I don't know why, but this rain just made me feel like I had to do something stupid, pretty much. <laughs> so, uh, since recording, there has been another update to Dragon Block C. As you can see, in the bottom right, we have our health bar again, which is all kinds of awesome. The only downside to that is I haven't really uh, put any points into it because... Well, at the time of training, when I was building up my key and stuff, I did not have any reason to, so it's kind of low right now. I might have to do a few uh, training moments off-screen real fast just to get the health up, but we're going to try our luck against Freezer anyway, since we have our system to be able to get back. Plus, I have an extra Freezer item purely because of training on stream a, a while ago. But, if you want to see more about the update, the information will be in the forum post. On this one, I want to primarily focus on the... Uh, the story, we want to try and get Frieza Saga done and pretty much wrap up the actual Saga progress at the moment and not really worry about updates because I, I generally have been giving you a lot of update news and I thought to myself, this one is just going to be about Frieza and just be about me beating Frieza, hopefully. Or dying terribly, that works too. I'm going to uh, get rid of my old equipment because it isn't very useful to me right now. Well, I mean it is, but it might break halfway through the fight. So, there we go. We're all decked out in our new Saiyan armor. We could paint it, I guess, but I'm not too worried about that. So, I don't really feel like there's much else I need to do um, to prepare for this fight. So, I'm just going to summon him and hope for the best. Um, let's see. What have we actually... Okay, so our attack power is 12. Our punch is 13. So I'm guessing it's either going to be... We'll start off with maybe some beam attacks and then go in for the melee hits. The only problem is if he gets close to us, I remember him dealing up to 200 damage a hit, which is ridiculously powerful. Uh, oh, I'm also going to have to be Super Saiyan to do this as well. A bit of misinformation have been spreading around about this update. Some people have been saying he added Super Saiyan 4. I'm pretty sure he hasn't. Uh, I remember trying to check in a test world I had, so I'm pretty sure he hasn't. Plus, I think that that would have been a terrible decision. But, um, hey, who knows. Anyway, again, not about the update. <laughs> I want to talk about it, but I'm just choosing not to. So, uh, let's just summon Frieza! Now, if I remember correctly, Frieza is completely uh, neutral until we attack him, or he gets to his final form. We could theoretically beat him in his first form, but chances are this won't happen because I'm not powerful enough, I believe. But fuck it, let's try it. Oh, he's already in his second form, so yeah, that's how quick it happens. Oh shit, I didn't go Super Saiyan, did I? Or am I Super Saiyan? Am I Super Saiyan? I'm not draining key, so I don't think I... No, I'm not Super Saiyan. That's really weird. The key isn't working for some reason. It's not charging when I'm... I know I'm attacking right now, but usually it would... I'm pretty sure it would charge. Yeah, I do have points in it. There we go. Since he transformed into his third form, he loses aggro, which is kind of funny in a way. That was really weird why it wasn't working before. I don't know why. All right, let's pick a move we're going to use. <laughs> Some people will notice a big difference in the spirit bomb's cost, by the way. Um, which is, is, I'm very grateful for that. All right. I mean, I don't know why in particular I'm deciding to do damage to him in this phase, because... He'll probably just transform and regain all his health anyway. Oh, how much? That? That didn't do much. Okay, yeah, that did a lot. Alright. <laughs> I'm like, he didn't do much to me then. I just wanted him to punch me just to make sure. I'm going to have to remember to also keep my, uh, my uh, stamina up. My hunger up, rather. The nice thing is, ah, since he's eating away at my Minecraft health now, 
Oh, I can't let him hit me too much, or else he is going to start hurting. Because, thankfully, because of the armor, he's not doing a whole lot to my actual health. I think he's full power now, yeah. Okay, so this will this will be the fight that counts. Like, this is the this is the moment that's counting right now. Oh god! Ooh, ah. Oh, he jumped over it. What? No. Ah, son of a bitch. Oh yeah, and he can fly too. By the way, you kind of expected that at this point, though. <laughs> Ow, 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 ow. Oh, what is doing that damage? Oh, ah, oh, son of a bitch. Uh, yeah, I seriously wish there was some way to um, regen your actual... Ah, DBC health. Oh, man, the beams are actually doing something, which is, is cool. I don't know if that was a change that was in the most recent update, where the beams actually, the enemy beams that is, actually do uh, a bit of damage, or I'm just getting hit by his explosions, I'm not sure. I've got to make sure I try not to kill him with the beams, of, with uh, one of the key attacks. I'm not sure if he'd fix that either. Because, <laughs> like, numerous bug fixes. I'm, I'm talking about the update at this point, aren't I? But numerous bug fixes, but it doesn't necessarily tell you what those bug fixes were. Oh, which is always a bit of a pain. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Retreat! Tactical retreat! Get the hell out of there! Oh! Ah! Oh, I died. Guess me am no real super sand. I don't even know how well I was doing. Ah! Oh. Alright, so I'm going to make it back to Namek. He might still be there. If he is, then that will be useful. Um, he might still be there. Oh man, I've got to remember the layout of the land. If he is, then I'll just continue wailing on him. If not, I'm going to train a bit more and hopefully get up some points. Oh man, I've only played this a little while. I forgot where everything was. There's the house and the lag. Yay. There's the ship. Let's just fly right there. We don't have to, anything to do on Earth at the moment. Alright. Uh, he was around here, wasn't he? Oh, he's still there! Okay, excellent. That means I won't have to worry about... Okay, but I do want to... I do want to at least put this on for now. Whoop. i got to get my stuff. Alright. Fly away, fly away, fly away. Freezer is scary. Alright, put that on, put that on. Okay, good. Alright. Now I can fight you. Hopefully just beat him up. There we go! Oh wow, I was very close to beating him before. Man! <laughs> that was a thing. Yes! We've beaten Frieza! We've saved Planet Namek! And we've revived all our friends, I guess. I don't know, that's... I guess you could say that. Uh, how many training points did he give us, though? Or, like, experience? 108! I'm not sure if that's because I used <coughs> key attacks. Some people have told me that it's a kill that gets you certain training points, but, or certain experience, but I'm not entirely sure about that. I am not entirely sure. I do want to test something. I can actually test that theory right now and use the second freezer item I have. Oh, I'm a bit of lag here. Oh! <laughs> Oh god, what is happening? There we go. So let me just summon this freezer right now. Okay, so we've got three. The idea is we're going to wail on freezer in his weaker forms. Yeah, weaker forms. Wail on him a bit, see what happens. So, uff, 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 uff. Beat you up for a bit. Until he gets to like second form, I guess, then I can just stop from there and see what happens. Alright, he's in second form and we want to wait. Uh, we want to continue beating on him until he... Uh, or should I just leave it at third form? I don't know. I don't think it matters, really. Ugh! That ticking damage is ugh, so annoying. Alright, third form. That'll do me. Ah, no. You can't fly away because you're taking damage. Ow. Okay. Well, it doesn't matter that I died. The point is I have experience. You see? 
I don't think it is from an enemy dying. I think it's per hit. And that that makes more sense than per death, I guess, because it means that you can still level up even if you failed to defeat a boss. And that makes that makes a lot of sense. So I'm pretty cool with it being like that. Well, I've lost all my stuff. My stuff is on Namek now, and I do not have the requirements to be able to get back to Namek. So, what I'm going to do in the next few episodes, uh, because I don't intend on ending this series just yet, uh, what I actually intend to do in the, uh, in the next two episodes is on the next episode, I'm hoping to fight <coughs> the actual legit Minecraft bosses and see how I do against them, the Ender Dragon and the Wither. Also, there has been a small update to Naruto C, and I'm actually considering, uh, as a little joke series or a continuation, let's say, of doing Naruto C progression, let's say, and the Jutsu style and the armor styles of that, but fighting the DBZ mod enemies. Like, because there aren't any bosses in Naruto C yet, as far as I'm aware, <coughs> I was thinking of using the Naruto C mod and fighting, you know, uh, Raditz, uh, Vegeta and Nappa and so on and seeing how far I can get without getting brutally murdered because there is a progression system in that now which allows you to get stronger. Plus, it might be a little more interesting because I'm going to have to start using Jutsu and, you know, start doing number commands. Anyway, tell me what you think of that idea in the comments. I'd love to know what you think. Uh, this video is probably a little bit shorter than the others but we wrapped up as a lot quicker than I thought we were going to, to be honest. Um, and hopefully we'll be able to, I might do some more training to be able to, uh, power up a few more times and fight the Ender Dragon and the Wither. So, thank you very much for watching. I'll see you on the next video. Okay, thanks, bye.